Hello guys, this is Acer Soldier and Medieval Architects and welcome back to another Minecraft video and I just want to talk about the city and I want to show you guys an update video today and this will be an update video to the city of Oakenshire which is the city I've been working on constantly and if you don't know where we are, we are near the place where Jeffrey liked that crane and as you can tell straight away across this bridge I've added a whole entire district within a week and I was really happy with it and right here in front of me is this nice butcher and I finally been talking about like trying to get get it built and everything and I finally got it done so I hope you guys enjoy that and if you're wondering what this redstone and stuff is on the ground this is our blood dripping off of where the meat used to be like trying to dry from hanging and all that or maybe from where it's getting cut up into pieces and sold through the market but Something I really like about this is just the hang, like the crane that's on top of the house that comes down and it has this nice storage crate inside the house, which is something that Jeffrey thought was a really nice idea to add. And across the street here, you have two nice, good sized cranes for any trade ships that come through, maybe to import and export goods throughout this whole entire world. But my favorite part about this district is just all the atmosphere, detail, and crowdedness that just come together and it all worked out so well and I'm really happy that I actually ended up finishing this whole entire district. It was a huge add-on and really helped me out a lot to this city. I think my city almost doubled in size because of this district. But I hope you guys really do like the greenery and all the randomization through this whole entire part of the district. I think I did more randomization here than I did any part of the city. And I really do like this stables add-on. If you guys like that, please post in the comment section below what you like about this whole entire district. And maybe if it's not the horse stables, maybe something else that you like about it, please post a comment below. So I know it's an update for later on. But I heard that uh, the horse stables and all that and all the hay bales and stuff, we'll be getting that next update and that'll be really soon. So I'm really excited about that and that'd be a really good add-on. If you guys want interior for like houses or something next, I'd be more than happy to do that. So you guys post in the comment section below and I'll see if I can do that. Um, I really am happy with this beacon tower design because this really, really added on a whole lot of height variation to the whole entire district here. And it's, as you can tell, it's right beside that tutorial where we did that market stall. And it does have like a repetitive design that beacon because it's just like the same design over and over again on three different levels. But it really was hard to put all that together, guys. And I really do hope you guys like it. And one of my favorite parts of this about this whole entire district is this marketplace. I think Jeffrey really liked this marketplace a lot too. So I'm glad that it ended up turning out that way, the way it did. And down this city, um, walkway there's that entrance to the next district in the whole entire kingdom but i have to finish the other side first so i'll get to that somewhere around christmas time hopefully and right here's a nice little storage area and i'm hoping you guys like these tunnels in this cross level building because that technique really has helped out and transform my city design by a whole lot and i'm actually hoping to add fleets and stuff into the oceans pretty soon like battleships and stuff so i can't wait to put tutorials out and stuff for that later on <clears throat> and this down here was a really good add-on a nice hangar place for a ship to just pour, come to port or whatever and like trade their goods and ships and stuff and I just all their shipments and stuff will come through here and I'm really happy with how it turned out it looked really nice and it ended very well and I added of course another one of these trees I love the trees on here that I custom made it takes forever to build them but they look so good at the end but guys, this has been another update video, and I really, really do hope you guys enjoy this update video, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next one, and you guys take care, let me know what you guys want to see in the future, and this has been Acer Soldier, Medieval Architects, and I'll see you guys in the next one.